Now on Fridays, the high school football coverage starts early in the morning here on CBS 47 with our morning matchup. Today, Fabiola Ramirez was at Menachi High School. Student body get ready for their matchup at Mission Oak tonight. You know, coming into this year, we thought Tulare Western was going to be good, Andrew. The Mustangs were returning a lot off last year's 11-win team that lost in the Central Section Division Three Championship game. But coming off a 4-6 and six season a year ago, Porterville's success has been a bit of a surprise. The Panthers really shining in the second year under coach Michael Machado. Both these teams a perfect 6-0, and Andrew, as they squared off in an East Yosemite League showdown tonight. To Porterville we go. Yeah, we got in the vehicles and traveled some distance tonight. The Panthers student section pumped up about their undefeated start. They'd have more reason to get excited early. Hector Nava to Hunter Alcantar, 7-0 Porterville. Now the Mustangs would answer Taryn Johnson. Some nice yardage around the left side. Elijah Burrell, well, he's got all kinds of time later, and he finds Rolando Holmes wide open over the middle. Holmes, a little shake and bake. He's going to the house, 14-7 Western. And the Mustangs would roll from there, 50-26 to the final. They're now 7-0. and And it's looking like that Bell game at the end of the year in Tulare could again be a battle of unbeatens because Tulare Union also rolled again tonight. No problem putting points on the board at Delano. That was Nathan Lamb who broke the school record for career touchdown passes last week. Adds another one to the tally, 6-6 Darius Baker on the receiving end there. Tribe wins it 52 to nothing. Like Tulare Western, Tulare Union is 7-0. CVC Cavaliers at Kingsburg, two 5 and 1 teams here. Vikings section pinked out tonight. First quarter, Jet Jackson pumps and throws a bullet over the middle to Jaden Spomer. First score of the night. Kingsburg would miss the extra point but takes a 6 0 lead. Cavaliers get into Vikings territory. The drive stalls, but they settle for a field goal. Luke Altermat through the uprights. Hey, kickers are people too. <laughs> CVC down by three. Second quarter, Cavs go for it on fourth and eight in the red zone. Eric dropped, tosses a beauty to Jalen Renning, making it 10 6 CVC. But in the end, it's Kingsburg who pulls out a tight one, 1916, taking command of first place in the Central Sequoia League at 2 0. Yeah, good one there. Coming up on CBS 47 sidelines. You'll meet another high school hotshot from around the valley. In this case, a former Golden Eagle who's doing big things on the links. As we go to break, though, check out more scores from around the valley on the Cooper Chase Construction Scoreboard.